Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to another nighttime pouring episode. HOA and I are here. It's 1230 in the morning. <laughs> I have woken him up and he has lovingly come and come to shoot this for us, which I'm so grateful for. Thank you, HOA. <laughs> no worries. Tonight we're going to be doing something I haven't done in a while. We're going to be doing a wandering ring pour with my split cup. This is a Tracy Reed split cup with a handle, which is kind of awesome. And uh, we're going to be using some awesome colors. So this is a 24 by 30 inch gallery wrap canvas from Artist Loft. I have painted my sides and edges and I have taped the back and put my push pins in. Let me show you my colors because I really love all of these. I'm going for a sort of more minimal palette. I'm only using four colors and my base coat color, uh, but there's some really, really pretty stuff. The base coat color is the drips from the last few pours. Um, the last one that we did <laughs> was that uh, Chaos Magical Pearl Pour Take 2, the repeat of the one that had something dropped on it. Uh, it's over there. It's not quite dry yet. So let me show you the colors that we're using. The first one is Golden's Payne's Gray. I love this stuff. This has actually been the star of the last several paintings, I feel like. It's just been gorgeous beautiful deep most of sometimes it's been a base coat sometimes it's been in the base coat and the pour but i love how dark this dries and i especially love it in contrast with some of the lighter colors like this one this one is arteza's glacier blue and it's beautiful just gorgeous stuff so the contrast between these two i am really looking forward to i love that okay so that's arteza's glacier blue pro glacier blue then I have here Amsterdam's Brilliant Blue, which is such a pretty color. Back when I was <laughs> learning to bloom with Karen Dershin um, from Waterfall Acrylics, this was one of the colors that I was just obsessed with and I really fell in love with. I love this Brilliant Blue. It's so pretty. So, and again, contrast between the Glacier Blue and contrast with that Payne's Gray. So next we have Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics and Champagne Gold. Mm -hmm. This is not the 24 karat, this is Champagne, which is a little more bronzy, which is kind of cool. A little more subdued than the 24 karat. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to layer our split cup, then we're going to put down the base coat, and then we're going to pour the, the split cup. So to layer the split cup, I definitely want that glacier blue on one side. So we're going to fill up this chamber with the glacier blue. And I definitely want the panes on the other side. Okay. And then I think I want the champagne next to the panes on this side. And then we're going to fill up that last spot with the brilliant blue. Okay. Alrighty. So that looks pretty cool. Let's pop that over there. Put our base coat down. It's not super, super thin, but I don't really want to water it down. It's what? <laughs> Three or four drips, paintings worth of drips here. All right, let's put this down. Okay, so we're going to be doing a wandering ring pour. Um, the best example of what I'm going to do right now I can give you is a painting I did called Misato, which was really, really pretty. It was like, like a year and a half ago. Okay. So actually we're going to kind of wander around, but doing a ring pour, yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay. I think Where we're going to start? start probably about here. Okay. Are you ready, husband of awesomeness? Yes, my little flamer. Here we go.
there's a lot of gold over here, but I love that Hades gray with the gold there. All right. I'm not gonna torch it yet. I'm gonna torch it after we tilt it out. So let's see, and I am okay with leaving some negative space in this color. Let's go down this way first. Just kind of walk it down. Oh god, there's a dillion cells all of a sudden. <laughs> Look up here. It's cool. I like all those cells. I wasn't looking over there though. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Let's see, what do we think about that top edge? Do we like the negative space or no? I do. Especially like the what's happening in, in the in the negative space. Oh, it's like kind of pearly. Yeah. I'm gonna take it back down. I just want to get some of this extra base coat off. So I think that's one of the things that's really awesome about this form is that you can paint that with a brush. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like. Yeah. All those cells and the way anything interacts with each other. It's so beautiful. And it's the only way to get it. You can't airbrush that. You can't paint that with a brush. It's killer. I think we need to take a little bit of the edge off. my boys in the island say, all killer, no filler. <laughs> okay. What do you think? AKNF, baby. All killer, no filler. All right. I like it. So do I. It's very different. There's a lot of cells, though. <laughs> yes, the, the glacier blue. Torch it now. I know it's a lot of air bubbles.
Do you think that we should maybe increase this and take some of that off or take some of that off? Or do you like it? No, I like it like this. You do? Mm -hmm. What did you want to take some of this? I mean, that part's cool, but I kind of wanted to open this up a little bit. I kind of like what's happening up here. I love this center bit right there. That's really yeah. cool. Okay, I think we're gonna stop there. Because I do like what's happening. I think it's really trippy. So this is pretty neat. Uh, that was surprising <laughs> and fun. So this was a wandering ring pour with our 16 ounce Tracy Reed split cup. You can get that split cup on her Etsy shop, Tracy Reed Designs. And uh, pretty awesome. So this was cool. I will show you guys when it's dry. Actually, I may not be able to show you at the end of this video because I am leaving for Texas in a couple days. And um, actually, I'll already be there by the time you guys see this. So I will show you guys when I get home for sure, along with the dried results from our Chaos Pearl Pour. So thank you so much for being here with us tonight. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. And uh, we'll see you real soon. That's cool. Yeah, I like it. I like the way that the blending and the striation. It reminds me of all those cells are like when the waves crash and yeah. there's like all that froth. Yeah. Sea spray flying up in the air. Yeah. Alien cool. sea spray. They're really trippy too. They're like these really beautiful colors. I love that the glacier blue mixing with the brilliant blue coming up against the panes like over in here is really beautiful. I don't want to drip on it, so. Yeah, please don't. Yeah. <laughs> Although, how could you tell on this picture? I would be able to tell. Yeah, I know. But this is neat. I like this a lot. So, that's awesome. <laughs>